Hello and welcome back. So this time uh, we are going to update our IGDIS uh, without USB. So it's contactless update through Navbox. This is uh, JRC IGDIS and uh, as per nowadays it's a big thing cyber security so uh, US use of USB is uh, up to the minimum and uh, so for this purpose only now uh, these IGDIS updates uh, are contactless you don't need to put any CD you don't need to put any USB it is connected to the nav, nav box and nav box is receiving updates via internet and from in nav box we will rec uh, receive updates directly to this we just have to select the path so the process I'm going to show you uh, as usual it starts from the uh, pop-up menu from the top I will open chart then I will go to chart portfolio and here is create so take some time it's okay yes now so it's initializing and now it is just showing this message it might take some time so just put press ok and now we have this uh, like this chart folio window uh, now I will go to tools and option and S63 so first of all I will you see here I have 2046 charts and uh, this 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 valid and all so uh, what I do normally is uh, delete all cell permit just to avoid any uh, expired or uh, not updated uh, cell from the uh, outfit I will first delete all now you can see down here it will show that you don't have any charts so we don't have any in ENC it means we are not licensed so it's uh, you have deleted all of them now I will start the updating process first of all uh, I will import certificate you don't have to do this every time but uh, once in a while you have to import the certificate as well so I'll just add this so here is the drive in drive you have to select nav box because it is directly connected to nav box and we have to receive updates from nav box box it's like if you have USB you used to use USB earlier and uh, it will show USB here now it is not showing any USB now it is showing nav box so I will select nav box here then I will open this file here it's again nav box and I will go to ENC and I will go to IVCS M4 scroll it down NAFTA and you see here certificate so certificate IHO and ok ok SC certificate is saved in the system alright we have got the certificate now I will import cell permit again open nav box this is again nav box just to show you from close and here you 
have E and C. A V C S M4 again. Nafta. Just give me a moment, guys. I'll uh, turn down the volume of VHF for a moment. So, back we are. Uh, now, permit. This two. So this is my this number two. For this this, I have selected the path. You see, from nav box E and C. This is this is my path to connect the nav box to my this number two. And what I want to receive permits. Now I have selected the permit. Okay. Okay. And okay so now basically what you have done is you have selected the path you have uh, what we call it you have laid down the pipeline now what we have to do we have to receive what we need so path is already selected uh, now before for selecting path we entered into s63 avcs before now we will enter into advanced advanced option so you see here it's already path is already here now I will go and I will just select the file what I need I need AVCS so ok 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 now first step was was to select the path second step was to what kind of file you need so we have done both of these files now we will come to portfolio and do this auto detect so it takes uh, uh, some time to detect because it depends on uh, how big file you have uh, like you saw I had uh, two more than 2000 uh, ENCs so um, updates are also too many so it takes some time and uh, but the thing is now it's better and easier than before yeah so whatever is included in uh, updates are included in uh, ENC will be here and after this one more step is there to update our AIO so I will show you uh, uh, the third step after this one so now it has detected that these are all the cells need to update it yeah so now I will select import update you see import update updates are now accepted now I press ok you can see here 128 updates are there and it's on the way to update so it's going all well we are getting updates uh, usually there is no any error or anything uh, but uh, sometimes there can be some error you know if your root is passing through some uh, cell that uh, is not uh, updated and but it is in your list so it can show error or one cell not updated anyway so now there's no error everything is updated okay buzzer is stop it's updated now we have updated our uh, enc now i will go again to tool this is the third step option advanced advanced option again select the file now before I selected AVCS now I will select AIO so I will update my admirality information overlay ok 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 again auto detect just a moment
so now we have detected the update to our AIO so what you have to do is straight away import the update it's it shows here so we have got this also updated now here you can see the log you see completed import update 128 updates were there unable to import 0 it means there was no an issue all are updated and uh, and then there is AIO update log it was checking this was the update to AIO we import up uh, imported uh, one update unable to imp import again zero so it's completed and okay if there is some error or something now it will be in a red color here so now you see all white and good and okay it shows looks all good so this is done now I will just exit it okay now I want to check my update report so here you can uh, okay I will check now again you open from the chart menu uh, you open ENC update report now uh, you can see here these are the charts total charts 2045 up to date 2045 not up to date 0 it's all good yeah this is the status report you can see here the ENC's and all our the status is up to date up to date so this is how we update our take this uh, weekly without using any hardware without using any USB so uh, to the nav box we receive via internet and once our nav box receives updates this mail is uh, uh, we get an uh, automated mail that to inform us uh, we receive this mail that your nav box is updated and, and uh, for this week and all once we receive this mail we know that our nav box is updated every friday so after that i'll come to like this and i will again follow these steps to my up, uh, uh, update my this. now this is uh, this number two it is what i have updated but number one it this is also remaining process is also same uh, process is all same nothing is different only difference is here we selected ICDIS 2 and over there you have to select ICDIS 1 when you will open the chart folio window chart portfolio window and when you will select the ICDIS then you will see the, uh, the number of both ICDIS so rest all is same nothing else so I hope it will help you and thank you thanks for your time have a good voyage.